Hello teachers, today I'm going to show you how to insert a Google Doc straight into your Google site. Go ahead and open your Google site and scroll to wherever you're going to want to insert the Google Doc. Now it's okay if it ends up in the wrong spot because everything here is drag and drop. As you can see I can drag anything that I wrote, anything that I put, literally anywhere on the page and it's that simple. So I'm going to want to put the document right to the right of this video because I'm giving my students an assignment asking them to watch this video and then answer response questions but my response questions are actually on a Google Doc that I created so this is helpful because a lot of you probably already have information on Google Docs that you want to use and you can't send it home with the kids because that's a lot of paper to print out so putting it on a Google site is a really good idea so this is a just a sample Google Doc that I created it just has three very simple questions that I want my students to answer after watching the video so what I'm gonna go ahead and do is on my Google site go to the right hand side toolbar now you can insert it by copying and paste the link on the text box you can insert it by hitting embed having this come up and pasting it right in there or you can scroll on down to where there's a docs button and as you see all Google education apps or productivity apps are right here you can embed a calendar doc slides etc but we're dealing with Google Docs so if you go ahead and click on that docs it will open up all of the docs that you have created sorted by the most recent you could go ahead and find your doc by by finding the most recent or by searching it in the search bar option. Mine is right here because I just created it. I'm going to go ahead and double click it. And as you see, it creates it right into the Google site. This is my entire document. Now, it looks more like an image. It zoomed in a little bit on it. But that's okay because my students now have access to these questions and like anything in Google Sites you can drag and drop. So I'm going to go ahead and click this and drag it up towards the video because I want them to know that these are the questions that are associated with this specific video. Now when your parents and students log on to this site and they see this, they will have the option of opening up this in a new tab just like we do right here with this little arrow and it'll actually bring them straight into this site but and I cannot emphasize this enough any Google Doc you create that you want shared you need to make sure everybody has access to it so in your Google Doc you need to make sure that you hit the share options and you may need to make sure it says anyone on the internet can find and view by default it normally says Anyone at Calvary Christian School with the link can edit or can view. You want to hit the More button and choose On Public on the Web, or you can do On Anyone with the link because they're going to have the link to it because it's on your Google site, and then go ahead and hit Save. If you do not do that, they will not have access to it. They will have to request your permission to view the site, and you'll get an email, and you'll have to approve them but it slows down the process. So make sure any Google Doc you embed into a Google site, the sharing settings are appropriate and you're allowing anybody to view it if they have the link or just anybody in general. You need to make sure you do that. But there you have it. It's that simple. You log on to your Google site. You scroll down on the toolbar on the right-hand side. You click on Docs. It brings up all of your most recent Docs. You click on the one you want and it embeds it right into the Google site. 